guys marty schwartz here from guitarjams.com hope you guys are doing great out there uh got a classic classic tune for you guys uh it's kind of riffy a little bit of chords in there uh with a smooth finish no i don't know what i'm saying anyway we'll zoom in break it all down i think you'll have a good time doing it uh also i'm going to leave a link for some bonus blues licks uh in that link right down there you can check it out they're not on youtube dvd quality i appreciate that extra support but let's zoom in right now and learn this one. Here we go. All right, so the main riff, it's all kind of like blues and E, the E pentatonic kind of idea. Um, now, the keyboard players, you know, the electric piano is playing the bass line, which is different than the guitar part. They're doing a counterpoint to each other, and it, they kind of both complement each other to become one riff. Um, now, the keyboard player, it's kind of good to know that riff, that bass line, and it looks like this. And it just keeps repeating that. So we've got the root, which is seven of the A string, it's an E note. Then we roll over to the seven on the low E. Then we play the five of the A. Then the seven on the D. Once again. The second phrase is the exact same, except you double up on that seven of the E. And you just alternate those. the main guitar lick and that's what we really want so we're gonna start with a rest so we'd go one two three four one beep bop and that beep bop is the second fret of the D to the open so one two three four one one two three four one okay so then we're gonna double up on the second fret of the D string so when you put it together one. One. Okay, so after we double up on that, we roll over to the second fret of the A string. See that one more time? So we roll over to that second fret of the A to the open D. Then we're going to go up to the 12th fret of the A string. And we're going to hit that 12th fret on the A string and then slide it down. Okay? You put those together. Okay, so right before it goes to the chord, right before it does that, you can go, it tends to do that. So just the last time of the phrase before you get into the chord, instead of, or sorry, instead of that, 
it's the open D to the second fret of the D. So the last one would be... And so I'm playing a D bar chord right here, which has got that root, the D note, on the fifth fret of the A string. You could play a regular D chord. I just like having the control over the whole... really dig in more with that when you play the bar chord right there um, as opposed to the open D but that's up to you they're gonna both work then we're gonna do this awesome lick that's great practice for the open E minor pentatonic scale or actually the open E blues scale and even one extra note so check it out we're gonna hammer on from the O to the 3 on the E then we're gonna play the open A string and hammer on 1-2 So, so far I only picked twice, check it out. Then, simply, do the same thing on the next string. So you put those together. Then we play the open G string. And we're gonna play it open, then hammer on pull off on the second fret of that same G string. You put that together. Then we're gonna play 202 on that D string, and I'm pulling it off. Put that all together. And finally, you know, it's going to keep going through those parts. Uh, during the some of the organ solo, you can do this instead. So instead of the, you can just do the open D to the second fret, you know, up to that root of E. Just because that slide could kind of interfere with the. <laughs> right? You know what I'm talking about. So we've got, instead, you know, for a solo. Now, there's a really cool chord. It's basically kind of like a Hendrix kind of thing, really. Um... So we're going to cover the 15th fret of the high E and the B, and those are the notes we really want to emphasize. But I'm using my index finger to mute the other strings, you know. There was. Hope you got something from it. Uh, one of my favorites, actually. Uh, oh, also, I've got those DVD quality uh, blues licks, extra bonus blues licks in the link down there. Thanks for hanging out. 
I truly appreciate the support and the comments and following me on social media, all that stuff. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Not only that, I'm going to make another video, and I hope to see you there as well. So take care.